Today we will be talking about a truce or war between Ukraine and Russia. What the planets have up their sleeves. I have written almost 16 articles on this and the first article was written somewhere in February, in the early February, probably on the 4th of February, that there will be a war like situations and Russia will invade Ukraine on the 24th of February. My, this prediction has proved spot on even for the day. Now, I have predicted, also predicted as per the time of invasion on the 24th February, 5 a.m. Kiev, that there is a possibility of a truce. And the planet is Moon and also Saturn. And on the 21st and 22nd, at late night 21st and early morning 22nd, there is a possibility of a truce because Saturn is the planet which is having Nakta Yoga with Moon, Jupiter and Mercury. It is said that when a war takes place, the Lagna Lord and Seventh Lord, when a planet has a Nakta Yoga between Lagna Lord and the Seventh Lord, a third planet which has got Ittisal and Moon has its will all of them, degree wise in fact it is taking place on the 21st late night it is taking place with even mars venus all the planets so that clearly means that number of countries they will put pressure on russia to withdraw the forces but the planet which is most important is saturn and saturn is in Mars star, it is in the negative sign, Capricorn it says is its negative sign and it is in a negative star. It can be ICJ because Saturn controls the justice, law. So ICJ can put pressure on Russia and the other is a person like Saturn, a person like Saturn who can be the person like Saturn, an old man? And in the present scenario, it is Joe Biden. And Saturn is not in a positive sign. Saturn positive sign is Aquarius. So a person, a person like Joe Biden, the only person can be Joe Biden because he is instigating the countries. So if ICJ and Joe Biden take part in the cruise, only then these situations can improve. If these situations don't improve on the 21st, 22nd, then again on the 4th of April, there is again a possibility of a truce because then six planets, six pla all the planets are having Nakta Yoga with Jupiter and Mercury. Why Jupiter and Mercury? Because at the time of invasion, Jupiter is the Lagna Lord and Mercury is the seventh Lord. And on the 21st, both are at the same degrees. And when Moon also reaches at the same degrees, together with Saturn is 24 degrees and Saturn is 26 degrees. So there is a possibility of a truce first on the 21st night and early morning of 22nd and then on the 4th of April. Between if it doesn't take place on the 21st, 22nd, then there will be fierce fighting between 21st to 4th of April. And then the president of Ukraine can come to his knees. And if he doesn't do it, and if the truce doesn't take place, then the situations can go out of control. And it will be worst somewhere around the eclipse which is taking place in May and around the 15th of May or early first week of May and then the planetary positions are 
extremely malefic and explosive when Mars joins Rahu in Aries, almost degree wise and Saturn, fallen Saturn aspects it, fallen Saturn aspects Ketu. The conjunction of Mars and Rahu is a Garak yoke. We can also term, is, term it as explosion. Most explosive Angara Kyoga is most explosive and that could be because of a nuclear war. So this is all friends. I just wanted to share that astrology says even if there is a positive parameter, it they, you should not rule out the possibility. So first I am looking at a positive stance of this truce from 21st to 22nd and if it doesn't take place then after fierce fighting the president of Ukraine will be forced to come on knees and if he doesn't do it and other nations instigate and join then things could explode. So this is all friends I just wanted to say I have written 16 articles and all well in advance it is there is no postmortem like the other astrologers and not a single astrologer has done precise and any research on it. Not a single astrologer has used the time of invasion and they are just predicting. That is no prediction. You have to start from Ebenezer, where from the fight has started. That planetary, those planetary positions are most important. They will tell you what is the situation, when, when things can improve. Is there any possibility of improvement because there is a Nakta Yoga, so there is definitely a possibility. So. So friends, this is all I just wanted to share and this will have an adverse effect on the stock and financial markets and rise of the Prussian metals and crude oil. So this is, this is all friends I just wanted to share. Please be very cautious in investment in the coming week because it can give a lot of people can suffer losses. As far as the stock and financial markets is concerned, one should keep away. I know what is going to happen, but I am not disclosing here because then people will start writing their comments. I don't want that negative comments. So I, I will not disclose it here, what is actually going to happen, but I definitely see a possibility of a truce. As I told you, astrology says that even if there is 10% possibility, you must consider it some part of it will definitely take place. So and till now there have been, I had mentioned that truce will take place and Russia gives time, you know, for breath. In between he is giving time for breath. So there is definitely a possibility of truce. If not very strong, but there is a possibility. So we we'll let, let us see what happens tomorrow and day after and then things would, will be exposed itself. So that is all friends I just wanted to share. Thank you very much for listening to me. Have a good day. Best of luck. Keep away from the stock market. My disclaimer clause is applicable here. So if anybody invests, he shall be responsible for his investment himself and I shall not be responsible in any way. Thank you. Bye bye.